Hello everyone. That's my failed attempt to RDA, but yeah. Let's move on, shall we? Hello, I'm Graham Babes, and it's time to review the other coil that came with the Smog TF V8. And this is the V8 T8. What exactly is it? It is four coils with jewel inside each one. So, eight coils really. How long did it last? Five days. Just five days of greatness, really. At 150 watt every day, all the time. And I chucked juice after juice after juice into it. And it was great. The flavour was just as good as a crown, which means a lot to me. And the vapour, as good as a Q4. Best of both worlds, really. So you've got masses of cloud, massive amount of flavour. You've just got that five days. Would it have lasted longer, less wattage? Maybe. Maybe I killed it with too much juice. I just throw one after another in. Really, I don't stick to the same thing. So, let's show you what it turned out to be like. So, on the fifth day, when it started to feel, well, taste burnt, I opened it up and had a look. So, let's see if we can get this in view. Yep, there we go. The typical view of your Kyle's ended. Burn Colin. Good sign, really. It'd have been much worse if it wasn't burnt and tasting nasty. So, the most expensive coil they do at the moment is the, the V8. And I can imagine why. It's good you know, on both sides. Cloud and your flavour. Do I rate it? Yeah, it's good. I want more. So now I've run out of coils. I need to go and get some more somehow from somewhere. I've been playing with the RDA that comes with it. And apart from the odd spit back or popping, it's, it's, it's okay, it's okay. Say I'm terrible at making the things. So, five days for this. Seven days on the Q4. Not bad, not bad at all. Pricey, it, the coils are a bit pricey, but you're getting what you pay for. They are worth the price. So it's my review for this one. The T8. I'll soon be trying to get hold of some new coils as well. So these, the X... Three is it? Oh, X4? Yeah, there's several other coils to get. And there's a random dog bark. Okay, that was the door. Yeah, we've got a weird dog barking thing. Doorbell. So the coils that I will be getting to review when they finally turn up is the V8 X4. Yeah, I think that's two coils and they're both dual. So that will be like a, a T8 but half of it. And what's the other coil? Let's hold up. The V8T6. So, possibly that's going to be three coils with Jewel as well. So, pretty strange. Which will be better than whatever else. And what I completely forgot to mention was this coil. The T8. It goes from 50 to 260 watts. I'm not going to know near that high. And for the best, it's 120 to 180. So, 150 was a nice middle spot for that. But yeah, that's my review for this Kyle. Thumbs up for this. I can't wait to get some more. If you've had it yourself, let me know what it's been like for you. Have you dared gone above 150? Have you gone up to the 200s? Um, what was flavour like for you? Did you find the crown any better if you've got both? The crown and the smoke? Just get in touch. Let me know what it's been like for you. Has yours lasted two weeks? Have I just, just battered mine too fast? Other than that, that's it so thank you for watching i hope it inspires you to go and get some well this tank and these coils really because they are good and uh let's attempt to blow a cloud into the camera and we'll finish this off wish me luck if you're on my youtube channel give us a like a dislike leave us a comment let me know how you feel about the review or just give us a shout say hello um, please click the click here to subscribe as well so I know you're watching if you prefer Facebook I do have a channel it's facebook.com forward slash grain vapes and not only the convenience of seeing my latest work in your newsfeed I have a categorized list of all the juices that I reviewed a whole A to Z so if you go to my page you'll see it it's uh, pinned at the top and you've got to click the continue reading I'll click here a bit and it'll show you the whole A to Z everything I've ever reviewed so should be convenient 
So if you've ever if you ever watch my videos from Facebook, just like and share the post. Spread the love. I'd appreciate that a lot. Last but not least, the begging part. That's right. All these are paid for myself. Yeah. It does get expensive after a while, so I can't exactly get new juice every single day. Unless I won the lottery, but I haven't. So, if you feel like digging deep and splashing out, because any donations sent to me will be mostly used for new juice, for new reviews, so self circle there. And probably new hardware in case anything breaks. So, how do you donate? If you're on my YouTube channel, there's a little link on the header that says Donate by PayPal. If you're on Facebook, there's a link as well saying Donate by PayPal. You want to click the link on there. Or if you'd like the address straight up, it is paypal.me forward slash Graham Vapes. Any donations received are highly thankful for because it just keeps me doing these reviews, really. But I'll keep doing them regardless. And thank you very much for anyone who does send any. If you've made it this far, thank you for watching it all. I can imagine quite a lot will just say, eh, turn it off, review's done. But you've stuck it out, good stuff, thank you. So it's time to vape to the camera, say goodbye, and I hope to see you again on the next review, because you're the people that matter. And I hope my reviews do help in some way, so just give us a shout, let us know if I've done something terribly wrong, tell me. Just as long as it's not involving my hair, it's a mess for a good reason. So, <laughs> other than that, here we go. Bye-bye.